video. That grate on top is temporary. I'm gonna chop that down to fit, but um, yeah, modified my camping stove so it sits on its end. You can still use it the other way. I left the, if you can see, I left the lugs on there. But with the door closed, it burns quite happily. And it's boiling a hole. I think that's about 10 litres. 10 litres of water boiling away. That would go with another 20 litres of water. No, another 10 or so for the shower. Gives you a nice shower. It's working well. Don't take much to get it going like that either. Hold on, let's see what I can do. I'm trying to do this one handed. I just, that's not supposed to be there. Okay, open it up. That's basically it. Just move the legs to the bottom. You can use it either way now. Oh, you get some heat from that too. Close that up. And when it's the other way around, I use four legs, but when it's like this, I've got an extra leg which I screwed on there. You can just hang stuff, whatever. Stick that in there, out of the way. Yeah, but if it boils that, the colour is um, shitty water, really, guys, that I put in there. Obviously, you know. You can put clean water in. Yeah. Bit of a success, I reckon. There's a long view. It's got those levels on it because our yard's not level. It's just to prop it up a bit. They won't be coming with me. Just gonna leave it on there, see how long it goes for. Anyway, here we'll look. Fine. Uh, it's burnt down a bit, but. Ah, oh, this wind. That's why I didn't go camping. Rain, I can handle the wind, I can't stand it. Yeah, anyway, this is without anything on it. I'm going to cut that grate down so it fits inside instead of hanging over the edge. Yeah, and that all unscrews and packs up into itself, guys. So it's just one thing to carry, not you don't carry it like that. As if you know me, you've probably seen it. open that up when you finish cooking and sit in front of it and I'll tell you what you get some warmth off it. Surprisingly warm. That's all good. And, um, <coughs> while we're here, this is probably not the pan I use to go camping with because it's crap Coleman $12 too thin. But that's the idea. Gives you the idea anyway. If you close that door now, here's the test. If I close that door, is it gonna. Should keep burning slowly and give you enough heat to cook on. Because there's actually. Um, air vents. It's the bottom of a gas bottle, you know, the holes. Yeah. There you go. Now that pan's a piece of shit. I suppose. Oh, it's getting hot now. If it rains, you can put the pan on it, open the front door and you've still got fire. So you can adjust it, like if it starts to go down, just open that a bit, and get a bit more heat. That's smelling good, There's something in there from last time burning away. Sausages, probably sausages. <laughs> something. Anyway. Sorry about the bad videoing, I'm doing this on my phone. Shouldn't be doing it on my phone, it's too hard to get onto the computer, but anyway. That's it. Let's put, focus. <clears throat> Just put some water in there so it doesn't burn the ass out of that pan. Not that I use it much anymore. Don't ever buy one of them guys, they're crap. Just burn everything when you cook. What do you reckon? There's Buddha Boy, he's in all my videos. Sit. Sit. Good boy. Stay. Drop. Come on, don't make a fool out of me. Drop. No, that's not drop, that's come. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, he's just been fit, so. He doesn't care. <laughs> Alright, guys. That's enough for now. We'll have it on.